guys this is American in Russia and welcome to my channel today I will take you to uh, Taganrog city where Anton Pavlovich Chekhov was born and lived in case you don't know who is Chekhov uh, that is one of the most famous Russian author of the short stories and he's one of the most famous authors in the world in general so before we start I give you a couple of facts about Chekhov that you probably didn't know so number one Chekhov was a professional doctor and he always been treating patients uh, till the end of his days two his grandfather was a serf and uh, collected enough money to bail out his himself and his family imagine that right three uh, his both eyes had different vision so he had to wear glasses with different lenses four he liked uh, to collect the letters uh, the receipts from the restaurants but his favorite was to collect uh, post stamps from different countries five his favorite dish was a fish in the sour cream which is a very easy traditional russian dish and six he had two favorite dogs uh das hunts and gave him and gave them uh, very funny names seven despite he was a professional doctor he also was a writer that he was famous for he had been saying the medicine is my wife but the writing is my mistress and the last one he always dreamed about children but unfortunately he never had a child so I hope you enjoy watching this video about his house. He was born in 1860 and his house where he was born, I'm showing you right now. Uh, just imagine how small it is, how people were different at that time. And uh, I'm there with my parents, you can see them on the video. And how I'm watching, walking around and constantly pausing at the description of the room. You can pause and actually read what is it about. And in general, if you have any questions, send it to the comments and I will answer all of them. Such a nice place. And... Да. And... A nice nice place very nice place look at this lawn I'm not sure if this is exactly how it looked like before like when Jacob lived here but this is his house uh, where he lived so let's see how it is inside oh look at this so cute oh здрасте тут экскурсии нет никакой а уже поздно. Да. Есть экскурсии, но это уже поздно. А он здесь родился? Очень жарко. Это маленький дом в доме. Look at this antique. Ай, мама. How huge it is, huh? Чуть-чуть. 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 Там что-то внутри еще есть. Oh my god, it's so cute. He was the third child. Oh, look at this. This is, this is the bed for two people. Imagine. It is like twin size right now. And this is his parents. He looks like Father Mo. And everywhere, of course, we have some kind of icon. Папочка. Папочка. 
This is the dining room. It looks so small. Oh my god. And of course, again, my icon. Russians are very religious. And that must be the Bible. Look at this. Can you hear the sound, right? It makes me crazy at my grandpa's house. But look at this. It's so cute and small. And this is samovar, traditional Russian kettle, uh, which warms up the water. And after that, we, you know, put it in a cups and drink tea. Oh, look at this. Look at this antique. I love it. I have noticed that everything here is so low. Like, I mean, the ceiling is so low. People were not, not tall back in the days. So, this is the living room. This is nine and a half. And this is for writing. Writing table. This is very traditional Russian flowers in the house. Look at this. Two little brothers slept here. The rooms are really, really small. А у них лишнего не было. Раньше тогда еще шкафов не было, не изобрели. Ну, у нас же как, э, весна, лето, зима, э, вещи, вещи, вещи. А вот кто занимался готовкой? Мама. Да? Мама. А вообще сколько у них всего детей было? Семеро Семера рождено было детей в Тарнароде. Последняя девочка только прожила два года, умерла от неизвестной болезни. Выросла пять мальчиков, одна девочка. Угу. Ну, получается, две спальни было. Гостиная и кухня. Сюда и сюда. И все. Нет, что-то я не... Шкафа, шкафа для посуды не вижу. Не... А, вот это тут тютина, да, шелковица. Mm -hmm. Здесь uh -huh. люди гуляют, а потом идут в музей. Ну да. Как однокомнатная квартира. Так, а электричества же не было, правильно? Они не чем было. лучина это вот, или чем там у них освещение? В начале были свечи и горели И потом вон керосиновая лампа. А у него было своеобразное письмо на библейский сюжет. Это тоже он писал, да? Да, это Василий Михайлович. Да, Чехов, вообще Ну, на этой фотографии тут Чехова нет самого, правильно? Тут родители, наверное, да? Здесь родители, а здесь его и не могло быть. Дедушка, бабушка, 
Отец, мама, младший брат отца Митрофана Горовича, его супруга Людмила Павловна. Фотографию на память Антон Павловича. Антон Павлович. Он настоящий Антон Павлович. Не желаете? Не похоже вы. Нет, такой вот усадьбы, конечно. Пойдем. I hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to me, send me some questions, leave a comment. I will answer, I will be pleased to answer all your questions about Russia and Russian soul. And uh, give me ideas what else you would like to see. I'm waiting for your requests. Okay, bye.